guys welcome back uh i figured today we would pick the world famous albert labelle pack lock logo lock uh i have picked this a few times uh twice today i got it and uh once some other random time when i wasn't even really trying but i've never been able to pick it on video and I cannot pick it consistently. I do not know why. This lock is... This, this lock gives me trouble. This is a difficult pick for me. And I do not know why. Because it's not overall difficult bidding. It's just... I don't know. The key wasn't cut very good. It's got the uh, nasty... Uh, I don't know why I don't know what you call it. But uh yeah, it, it's not a difficult uh it's not a difficult bidding, it's just the lock gives me a lot of trouble. And I have no explanation for it. When I actually sit there and try to pick it, I cannot, so, I don't know. Hopefully I can pick it for you guys today, and if not, then, uh, I have no idea. I don't know. It gives nice feedback, and then, uh, I get towards the end where I sh think I should be open, and, uh, it's just dead. It 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 gives me nothing else, and I don't know why. So uh, we're gonna try to get in, try to get in it uh, together. Hopefully we can. I'm gonna zoom in a little bit for you guys, and hopefully uh, we slay this dragon, man. And that is not gonna be it. Not like that. I hate using this side because it always hits the pin. But uh, I'll just have to consciously check. Alright, let's go. All the way to the back. This is a six pinner. Click off six. And I'm using moderate to light tension. Click off five and a little core movement. I'm going to leave four alone for now. I'm not. No, yeah, I'm gonna leave four alone. Click off two. Click off three and a little more core movement. Three, a little counter. Nice click, a little more movement. Two and a click. With a little more core movement. And a nice little false set. I think one might be set. Six is definitely set. Five is good. Four fights back. Now I just lost everybody, so. Okay, there we go. Nice click. Well, I lost the two in the front. I'm going to leave him alone. Go to two. Two kind of mushed on me. Click out of one. Click out of three. Who's kind of fighting back and a little click and a little more movement? Four's trying to fight back. And then as soon as he does, I lose a pin and I can push it and you hear it click. 
Hear that? That's why I believe it's a nasty little serrated. And this is about where I get lost. But I have let tension off around this time and then picked three pins and then got it open. So maybe I'm oversetting one of these guys that I think is a click, but yet it's a overset. So let me try that now. Release a little tension. Yeah, I'm going to go with that for now. Click out of two. I'm definitely mushing one. Okay, that was a little different feeling right there. I think we're almost open. We got the nastiest full set. But, uh, I think I'm one pin off. Which one is it? Hopefully, I don't pick wrong. I think it's one. Or maybe not. No. Unless he's a really high cut. And he is. Oh, oh, baby. There we go. Okay. Finally got it on video. It only took uh, five minutes. See? When I uh, release a little tension, so it's obviously an overset. Uh, it is an Allen key. Is it this one? Yes, it is. Oh, nice. That's cute. Okay, I don't have to scratch my lock. Cool. Like I did with the logo, or the... Um, oh, that's why. Like I did with the, the Mako. Where I had to get on the... Top of the lock. To, oh, I'd help if I was in the Allen key, huh? Or the... The Allen screw. Alright. You bastard. Sorry about the delay, guys. But, uh... Surprised the hell out of me. Oh, it's already out. What am I doing? Oh, and there was, uh... There was a Loctite on there. But, uh... No bypass wafer. Huh. <laughs> Okay, I have to use this pinning tray because my other one is being used with my uh, I can't even talk right now for my uh, challenge lock. I'm sorry. Is this a cr it is a crimped core, so I do not have a crimped core follower, but we can do it like this. We'll just go to like this, huh, guys? Mm. 
Yeah, that's the top. Okay. Let's go with it, I guess. Barely breaking the shear line. That is uh, a standard for pin six. Spool for pin... Oh, yeah, spool for pin five. Spool for pin four. Spool for three. Um, I'm gonna have to look at that one. Uh, serrated, double heavy serrated for two, and uh, spool for one. I don't know. I have to look at that. Uh, doesn't look like anything much for uh, key pins. Wait, what? Okay, I didn't see which one was which, so I'll have to go back to the video. Hopefully I can figure it out. I do know this one was that. I'm guessing that was there, but I'll have to go back and look. Uh, these are your pins. Nothing much for the key pins, but the drivers. I got one standard in six, a spool in five. Uh... Heavily serrated, double serration in four, spool in three, heavy serrated in two, and spool in one. And these are what was giving me such a hard time. Hold on, guys. Yeah, and that's what you heard, those real loud clicks, that's what it was. But that is all I have for you today on the Albert LaBelle a Logo Lock. Finally got it on video. If you like what you saw, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, uh, shoot the thumbs down. If you're not already, please subscribe, and like always, guys, shoot me a comment. Uh, let me know what you thought. Uh... Drop by and uh, give me a suggestion of a new lock or a challenge, whatever, and uh, just say hi. Hope you guys enjoy your week. Have a good one. Bye.